Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, hi, I'm Lindsay, and welcome to my YouTube channel. I would really appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, and hit the little bell button right next to it if you want to get notified every time I post a new video. Today's video is going to be an updated body jewelry collection. I did one of these exactly a year ago in March, and I was like, eh, I've changed a lot since then, so I figured I would just do another one for you guys. Before I get into the video though, I know I'm going to get a lot of questions about my lips. This is a really, really cool color. It's called Unicorn Tears, and it's by Too Faced cosmetics and it is really cool because it starts off blue and then when you put it on it's like a pinky purpley iridescent color not sponsored I just figured I'd share it with you guys because I love this color and I don't get to wear it enough so let's get right into the body jewelry collection video I hope you guys enjoy this and do give it a thumbs up if you do enjoy it so just like in my last video I keep all my body jewelry in this cute little mermaid resin container thing. I have them all packaged as in what piercing it is. <laughs> so like I have all my navel jewelry in one package, all my nose jewelry in a package, stuff like that. I also have this other container that holds all of my earring ooh, holds all of my earring hoops and ear things and things that I just tend to grab a lot I just put in here so it's easier. I think I'm going to start off with the hoops. I'm just kind of counting my earring hoops as body jewelry because I did downsize my ears as you guys saw in a few videos ago. I told you why I downsized my ears so instead of plugs I'm wearing hoops now and I just absolutely love hoop earrings. I think they're so cute and they just really make any outfit look 10 times better. I have this gigantic <laughs> bear. I have had these for years. They're so big, but they're really light because they're really thin. So I have those. And then I also have the ones that I'm wearing. I also do want to say I get all of my body jewelry from Hollywood Body Jewelry and Body Vibe Body Jewelry. So all of the body jewelry is going to be from Hollywood Body Jewelry and Body Vibe Body Jewelry. And then the hoop earrings, I just get it like Target and icing. <laughs> Next pair at Target. Actually, these are so cute. So they are red heart hoop earrings and they just have a really cute little clasp so it's you can wear these whether you have stretched ears or not since they just kind of come apart like that. I always buy the hoop earrings that just kind of fit into each other or they have a little clasp like this because they're easy to wear if you do have stretched ears. This is another pair of just basic silver earrings. They are a bit smaller than the other ones I showed you guys. <laughs> Quite a bit smaller and they're a little bit thicker as well. These guys are probably my most worn pair of hoop earrings and whoop, I'm just dropping stuff everywhere. They are tiny, tiny little guys, but they're just really, really cute. They're just great for everyday wear because they're not too in your face, but they're also there. These are about the same diameter, but these are a lot thicker. And these ones I got from Hollywood Body Jewelry, and they just click like that. My ears are more at a zero right now as they're shrinking, but these are twos. And they are these dangly, really beautiful earrings. I actually wore these at IMTA. If you guys saw my last video about IMTA and my experience at IMTA, I wore these for a fancy dinner that I went to there. And these are just really pretty because you can't tell they're plugs when you have them in. So that's why I really liked this pair of those. And they have like a navy blue gem with little crystals around it. I have like, I don't know, 10 extras of the little nose studs that I wear. These ones are just the l shape no studs, they are a 20 gauge and they have this little tiny CZ, looks like a diamond, and they're just an L. Pretty basic, but this is what I like to wear every single day, so. I do have these red gemmed nose rings, I hope you guys can see. So yeah, they're just L shaped ones as well, just with the red gem. These are the purple opal ones, I know they're really hard to see because the opals don't like reflect. But they just are like a purpley, they kind of match my lipstick actually, so they're just purple iridescent opal. I also have the regular white opal ones as well. I have way too much belly button jewelry and a lot of it's going to be pretty similar to the last video, but I do have a new, I do have some new ones that are really pretty. I have two navel piercings, I have the top and the bottom, so I tend to buy them in pairs. I have this really pretty emerald green stone and I have a smaller one to go like that on the bottom. These are the same exact thing but with red stones and then the same thing in hot pink as well. One for the top and then one for the bottom. I have a bunch of these guys and these are just really basic navel jewelry. They, these ones don't have any gems and they're just curved bars um, with beads and then I also do have some with gems on them. And they're just pretty much all the same. Some have gems and some don't. And these are just what I typically wear in my navel when I'm not, you know, going somewhere, going to the beach or something. These are just for everyday wear because they're comfortable. So I have 
uh, quite a few backups of those. Aurora Borealis and then regular diamond stoned ones. I have this one blue one. This one's really pretty. I usually don't wear acrylic navel rings, but this one I just really liked. It is a curved bar, obviously, and it has a black ball and then it has red gems on the black ball. As for my newer stuff, I got these really really beautiful ones covered in crystals and these are the Aurora ones right here and they are so beautiful. Like look at these. Look at those. They are so pretty. I have them in a smaller size and these are the regular diamonds, not the Aurora. The next set is these two dangly flower navel jewelry pieces. And this one is Aurora and then this one's regular crystal. It's a really pretty one. I've had this for so long and it's like this brass colored butterfly dangly navel ring and it actually moves right here which is cool. The design's at the bottom so that's just a regular navel jewelry. And then this one's at the top and it moves as well. And they sit like that and they're just both butterflies because I love butterflies. This really interesting purpley green gem with um, gold and it has this little like gold sun on the top. It's kind of interesting. I have this like little bull ring one. I have another top down navel ring and this one moves as well. I like the ones that move for some reason. And it's just like this really big heart so it just kind of covers your entire belly button. I have this really pretty uh, flower mandala type. I'm not going to take these out for you guys because there's so many of them. But these are all hoops for various things. Most of them are for my ear cartilage and I have a few horseshoes in there as well that I put in my septum. But there's just so many and they're just really basic clicker hoops. I actually don't have my eyebrow piercing anymore so it's kind of sad but I have a bunch of extra eyebrow jewelry. I'm not going to show you guys because I, I'm not going to wear them at all but yeah I just have some random eyebrow jewelry in here from when I did have my eyebrow piercing. Really cute little quarter inch diamond earring for my conch and I have something similar into this right now but this is just an extra one. Moving on to industrials, I have these two opal industrial bars. I have an extra just basic barbell for my industrial. These are the same as the navel rings I was showing you earlier that are really sparkly and they have a bunch of little crystals all over them. And I have a few different lengths um, and a few different finishes. I have the Aurora and I have the regular crystal. And these are so pretty. This is what I wear during the summer when I have my hair up a lot. For my conch piercing, these are little quarter inch studs. And they are the same little fun crystal covered beads. Two are, these ones are Aurora and the other ones are crystals. Hope you guys enjoyed this little body jewelry update video. I will link my last body jewelry video in the description box. And please do check out all my social media right down below in the description box. And I will also have my handle right here on the screen for Instagram and Twitter. If you want to go check me out on there, I post almost every day. So definitely go follow me on there. Hit the thumbs up if you did enjoy the video, and please subscribe if you'd like to, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!